Hello, I'm Ryu Jiang, a breast surgeon at Puchon St. Mary's Hospital. Simply put, it's cancer in the breast. There are many types of breast cancer based on where the cancer develops. And I'll explain later about these specific types of breast cancer. According to national statistics, from mid-40s to 60s, they're the ages most likely affected by this. Of course, you can also get diagnosed at an earlier age. And there are patients who are in their 70s or 80s. If you're a 40-something to 60-something, you should get regular checkups if you can. According to the WHO International Report, it's reported that breast cancer patients are increasing from the age of 40. Breast cancer can be classified into many types. First, it can be classified based on where it develops. Breasts can be divided into ducts and lobes, and breast cancers can be classified into ductal carcinoma in situ and lobular carcinoma in situ. It can be further classified depending on whether it's invasive cancer or pre-invasive epithelial cancer, so there would be histologic classification. Other than that, there's also the molecular classification, but that really won't be directly mentioned to the patients. There are many risk factors to breast cancer, but the most certain things are the age and sex of a person. As I mentioned before, it's being reported that the chances for breast cancer increases from the age of 40. Women are more prone to it with their female hormones. And while it's not true that men cannot develop breast cancer, it is incredibly rare. So if you're a woman, the risk of breast cancer is really high. Besides that, the risk of breast cancer increases from being exposed to estrogen. If you have your first period early and your menopause late, the exposure period becomes longer. And inversely, having a late first period or early menopause, the risk of breast cancer drops a little. Okay, so I briefly talked about the definition of breast cancer, the types, affected age, and the risk factors. Thank you.